welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Rosie Henshaw. If you're new here, then welcome. It's lovely to meet you. If you're already existing, then thank you so much for coming back. I really, really do appreciate you guys. If you're not yet subscribed as well, please consider hitting the sub button. It's completely free to do so. And if you hit the notification bell, you'll be alerted when any new videos are uploaded. I'm really out of breath because I just started filming this and then remembered that I left Sank in the car. And it's a pretty important bit. <laughs> it's something that I got rather excited over when I was in home bargain. So Oh, let's get in. So today's video is, you would have seen in the title of the video, is a home bargains haul. Oh, one, I love home bargains. Two, I love a haul. And three, it is Christmas stuff. Now, I know it is October. I know. Why do they bring this stuff out so early? I know this is naughty and I know people will be like, Rosie, let Halloween go. But I know that if I don't share these bits with you, they are going to sell out. They're just too good. They're amazing. And actually, when I went to Home Bargains last Christmas, I had some amazing bits. And the year before, and you're probably thinking, what's different? The difference is, this year, for some reason, they've brought such new stuff. And I said to Lady when I got to two, I was like, there's some amazing bits. She was like, honestly, we've got more coming. She was like, but we've never had so many aisles dedicated to Christmas. They've really brought out some really amazing bits this year. So we're going to get in, and I'm going to start off. I've got my receipt ready. And I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you the first thing I left in my car. So I got this doormat for Christmas, which I thought was just adorable. And I'm sorry, but look at this. Candy cane lane. It is so cute. It looks like it's from Anthropology. Guess how much this was, guys. It's PVC backed and it's a choir doormat with all the candy canes on it. And it looks like it's bespoke. You can either got this on Etsy or Anthropology. I paid three ninety nine for this, like under four pounds. That's unbelievable. So I got that. They did have other designs. They've got like gawks as well, some other Christmassy designs too. Three ninety nine, which is just incredible. So I got that. And yeah, I'm just excited to show you. I even actually took a little bit of video as well with some of the um, serveware and pottery bits because actually there were so many new bits in there and I can't justify buying everything and I can't afford to either. So I've got little snippets as well to show you so you can obviously have a look as well some of the bits that I didn't pick up. I'm going to start off in this one first. So we love a good game at Christmas and we do actually have a cupboard under the stairs where it's designated where all our games, puzzles and stuff go. We love a Saturday fart. Saturday, Saturday <laughs> night so we love playing games and stuff together and christmas is no exception so i did get this one i haven't seen this one before so in this party game each player gets six christmasy missions to pull off first to three wins so there's things like say that it's just started snowing outside and get a player to go and check like it's like a really fun little game don't get what it's called party christmas game age 10 plus two to ten players and i paid for this Sorry, guys, I'm just going to go down. Where is the game? I always think I've not paid for these things, but I know I have because I definitely put it down. Where are you? Right. Oh, don't get crazy. $1.99. $1.99 for that game. It's really good. It comes in a cute little box, and you can obviously stick this in your games ready for each year. My Christmas games just stay where my normal games are. And sometimes in the year, we actually just play the games. That's fine. Um also got i'm sorry but this this is also like etsy vibes this is so so nice so so nice it comes in silver as well look at this tree topper it's christmas now this is 199 and i thought this was beautiful but you know what i'm gonna use this as a tree topper I even thought to myself, if you are doing like a display of like food or doing a buffet, you could quite easily bend the bottom of this and use this as like a topper in a cake or use this as a topper you know, like in the middle of the table with different bits in that. It's Christmas. And I thought that was so cute. It's so lovely. It's like bent wire and this is in the gold. $1.99. Like I say, they had the silver, but you could easily spray paint this into any colour that you wanted this to be. Um, $1.99. I just thought that was really good as well. Like, they're really pulling it out of the bag. Like, the decorations and that was like, when I went down the decoration aisle, I kid you not, if you're going to get Christmas decorations this year, please just go to Home Bargains first because it's the best place to go at the moment. Um, I've got to save the time for after. 
So for $2.99, I've got some of these candy canes. Now I got these because I thought these are good for little guests that come round um, because, because they've got little sweeties attached to them. So each of these candy canes have got a little jellied sugar sweet, either like a reindeer shape, penguin, Santa Claus. Um, so I got these as well. These were, these were, what am I on about? How many did you get in this? Three, six, you get 12 of these. So you get 12 of these for 2 99 which I thought was really good. But what I love about these is I love wrapping up my presents individually, in like brown wrapping paper, because obviously it's recyclable. Um, and I just use my own ribbons and stuff like that. So when you're wrapping up children's gifts, sometimes it's quite nice just to add a nice little candy cane to the top, because rather than having all the really over, sort of like very Christmassy wrapping paper that makes their eyes drawn to it sometimes, you want the kids to be drawn to it and if it's brown wrapping paper and you pop one of them with a little red bow around it that just makes it a little bit nicer as well so i've got those i got this purely because so many of you when i done my christmas house tour last year hadn't seen the home bargains haul that i done so i've got these to show you these are back in again one pound 29 they've got the big paper trees so the organza trees literally they're all in my shed they've popped away for this year and they are magnets inside these. Oh no, not these ones. The ones I got from the garden centre are magnets. These ones come with, I think they've got paper clips in there. Yeah, they do. And what you do is you just paper clip it together. They're in the most lovely for coloured forest green, like a deep green. You like pin it all the way around. And if you want to keep these out, up like this, if you've got the storage, you can obviously hot glue these together, but they do come with little paper clips where you paper clip them together like that and you get the organza paper trees. They don't have different sizes. That's the only little annoying thing. But they did have, if you wanted to make a little village with these, they did have a garland of this colour green paper organza tree. So you could maybe get the packet, not put it on the ribbon, attach it to the ribbon and have a few little ones next to it. But £1.29, that garland set's £1.29 as well. But lots of you love these when I done my Christmas home tour last year. And I wanted to show you that obviously you can get them really cheaply in home bargains. They are a bargain from there because like some of them are like eight nine pounds aren't they i know in next and marks and spencers they're quite expensive yet again for my christmas north pole breakfast for the kids i always get one of these every single year and it is a color your own tablecloth so i have decided this year i am going to do a north pole breakfast video to show you what i'm going to do is i'm going to get all my pottery and stuff out set it up the table so i can show you exactly what i use i'm going to show you all the bits that i buy for it as well so basically set the table up first of december usually it's first of December. sometimes we do the saturday before or after whatever's closest to the first so that gary can definitely join in with it and um, like i said the other day i think he's only missed like one before um but they come down and the elves come that day like our cheeky elves they're on the table and there's marshmallows there's cereals they're not normally allowed to have pancakes chocolates blah, blah, blah. so many of you probably heard this before so i don't bore you but one of the things we do is leave coloring pencils at the table and have a colour your own tablecloth as well. They do do the placemats in there as well. These were also, where is your colour your own tablecloth? £1.29 and the placemats were £1.29 as well. I think you get four of those. But I do the whole tablecloth because it protects my table and they get to colour it in and it's fun and they get to eat naughty sneaky treats for breakfast because normally I make them eat something quite good that's not got a lot of sugar in it. So yeah, got this. Also as well, I got this for my friends. So I get these every year. So if you've been around on my channel for the last couple of years, you won't be no stranger to what I'm about to show you because I get them every single year. However, this year I got this, it's a pound. Well, it's, you know, let me just double check. Planner, I think it's 99p. Yeah, planner, it was 99p. So it's a pound, but a penny less. 99p Christmas planner. And it's lovely pop it in your bag and in this they have you get your little christmas notes that you can take out that you can pop in your handbag you've got your name your email and contact in case you lose it master to-do list in here you've also got a section for plans by month so you've got a few months you can plan up in the lead to um in there you've got november october <laughs> Go on then, let them have it. Go in the basket quickly. Calm down. I honestly, it's so funny having a little yucky dog. <laughs> Do 
Do you know what the funny thing is? Someone said to me before, they was like, Bertie yaps a lot, your poor neighbours. And yeah, bless them, my poor neighbours. They are really lovely. We've got lovely neighbours either side. We've got Val and Al, who are really nice. We've got Maureen and Bill, who are really nice as well. Um, and they're just incredible neighbours. They really are. But I will just say, it isn't like he's yapping all day long. I find when I'm in here filming, he's my little lap dog. He's stood next to me all the time. So when I'm stood here and I'm sort of not cooking and stuff, when I'm cooking, he just stands next to me watching what I'm doing, waiting for food. <laughs> or he's just like, you know, about. But while I'm filming, he gets a bit bored. He doesn't sit next to me. So he just sort of sits on the floor in front of the windows and then just looks out the window. So it isn't something that he does all the time. So he then sees the seagulls. And barks. He probably wants to come in now. He's a little wee. One sec. Sorry, guys. This is a video, but you know, Bertie is my little fur baby. He wants to come in. Come in. Come in, then, silly boy. No? Are you coming yet? Okay. He's heard something. I don't know what he's heard. Right. So we've got a section, sorry, we've got a section for cards and presents. We've also got foods and drinks section here and additional notes. And there's lots of different bits. Now I know in the food and drink section, you have like menu for meals, um, shopping lists, stuff like that. It's really good for 99p. Now I have actually ordered myself one off eBay this year. So I'm gonna save that for my friend. And I've also got a something else in this. I'm gonna drop it off to her doorstep because I know she always gets this. Just as like a little, little gift I did get myself. This one off eBay, so I do love a bit of calf kits then. And I ordered this and it was brand new and it's the vintage kind of design calf kits and Christmas planner. I always used to get them and then they just stopped doing them and I was always gutted. And I was looking for Christmas planners online because I like to do things early and I found this one come up on eBay. So it's just bringing all the nostalgia of all the patterns. So I got this one, so that's for my friend. And then for Night Night Pete again, I got myself the magnetic Santa, it goes on my fridge, it comes with a little candy cane pencil, and what I do is, is use it for any notes quickly for Christmas. They did have a snowman design of this. This design's changed like this year, and I will just say, everything they've got in there is very, very, just go on that Anthropology website and you'll know what I mean, or the website Merry Merry. It's all that really lovely cartoony Scandinavian, but really expensive looking bits. They've really upped their game with the cartoony looking bits and yeah so 99p on my fridge they're just handy to keep you organized for christmas and then i've got for one pound 49 each these are just going to be popped on top of the kids presents um, i'm going to get them out it's like a red ribbon and it comes with a solid gold looking it's gold foil chocolate coin and it just says santa nice list approved and um, so i'll just Put them on i might even just pop these in their stockings um but i thought they'd be really good but i've not been doing stocking stockings really anymore because i found i was just filling them with just stuff and they don't need just stuff do they they get more than enough um so i think like maybe just a bit of chocolate and something like that in there maybe little just knickknacks that i get them anyway but then pop them in their stocking um but yeah one pound 49 each i've got four of those honestly when i show you the china that's the bit that's got me so excited, it's all the surfwear. Oh, I did also get, for 3.99, I got this, so it's a little gift box. How cute is that wrap? I mean, like, look, the classic brown cardboard box and the red ribbon on it is beautiful. It's got the little Santa, which you could take off and put your own tag on this to make it like you've gift wrapped it yourself. You know, something that I would do. <laughs> But you've got four bar fizzers in here. So you've got one that's a gingerbread scented, one that's peppermint scented, one's vanilla, Oh, two is vanilla, um, and you get bath fizzers. So I got this, I thought, what a lovely little gift, and it's really nice, it's beautifully wrapped, and what I'm probably going to do is take the bath fizzers out to go into the children's Christmas Eve boxes, like their hampers with their PJs in, take them out, but reuse the box for a gift. You know, it's just so beautifully wrapped. I also got, so they have some amazing little books in there as well. These are perfect gifts for children. They're so good value, and most of these are like RIP, like $6.99 and up. And this book here is 79p, so I got The Santa Expert. It's a hilarious tale that will make you think twice. Um, really, really good. And I really loved it as well. They've got like little inclusive characters in this one as well, which is really nice as well. And then we've got The Night Before. It was The Night Before Christmas, 79p as well. And yeah, just really good, really nice little illustrations. These are perfect. And these are perfect little books as well to stick in Christmas Eve hampers if that's what you do, Christmas Eve bag, box, whatever you do. Um, but ultimately, they are a beautiful gift as they are. 
get one of these books, wrap them up with some brown paper ribbon and stick one of your little candy canes on the front. Gorgeous little gift for a kid. They'll sit there eating their sweets and their candy cane, reading their book. And yeah, really, really nice. I got this for Albert. I'm unaware whether I'm actually gonna put this away for his birthday, which is tomorrow, or if I'm actually gonna, um, not tomorrow, next day. I'm gonna give it, put it away for Christmas. It's like it's Paw Patrol, it's from Melissa and Doug. I think this was $1.99. Um, and what it is, is a reusable colouring book, but you fill this little pen up with water, but he's absolutely obsessed with Paw Patrol. And it's just got loads of different little pages in there. So when the water colours in, it's like, you know, one of them messy mats that you used to be able to get for him. But it's just got all of this on it. Hi, baby. That quickly, in case you see is that. Um, See, so yeah, I got that. Now I'm going to go into the china. I am going to show you what I got, and then I'm going to insert a little clip too, because obviously there was just so much. I got this platter. How much should I pay for this platter? Where is he? Hey, baby. You came with me, me. Hello. Don't let him see up that side. <laughs> I got this gingerbread snack plate. You want a biscuit? Biscuit. Biscuit. Ooh, thank you. Say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So I've got this gingerbread plate and I got these. This was 3 99 This is from their home collection. It is hand wash only, not microwave safe. Um, even though I never normally listen to that, just pop them in anyway. Look at this plate with the sections. It's got these like little free little stands, what they call debossed when they're out bigger or embossed. No, embossed is in, debossed. Candy canes, chocolate, gingerbread biscuit stars. 3 99 this is just going to be lovely for up the table with nibbles on and it really goes lovely with my little Emma Bridgewater stuff that I've got, it blends in lovely. So I've got that and then I've also got these. So this mug was £1.79 and in the video clip that I will show you, it's got the green version so it's like white with a sage green and it's got little trees and stuff on it. Look at this jolly mug. This looks so expensive, like you would not expect this to be from Home Bargains at all. And it's got also the little like snowflake inside. And this is embossed, so it's actually like grooved in as well as painted. And it's got like the red rim on the bottom. Such a nice size mug as well. Make some like little hot chocolate spoons, handmade, pop these in it. Just a lovely little gift, £1.79. And then I got these as well. So these were, these mugs were... Ooh, where are they? Mugs for two ninety nine. So these are two ninety nine each, and I just thought these are yet again. I don't even tell them it's an anthropology in a video that is an anthropology, but they're just gorgeous, like amazing. It's two ninety nine. I've got this gingerbread mug. It's ribbed, which is really really nice. So you can see. Yet again, it's got the debossed little um, gingerbread man on it. The handle is red and white striped candy cane. It's just gorgeous and it kind of goes up in the shape. It's beautiful. And then I also got, I really wish I'd have just got the Mrs. Claus now, but then I thought well, I'm not really into Mrs. Claus and Santa Claus, but I like the Santa Claus one. $2.99, look at that Santa mug. How, I'm sorry, $2.99? That Santa mug is just gorgeous. Um, So lovely, red rim on it, red handle. Santa's little face, look at Santa's little face. I'm sorry, but how beautiful is his mug? So, so nice. I have seen ones in high street stores like this, not as nice, so much more priced with it than this, like more expensive. Yeah, I love this one, it's so, so nice. I'm thinking of giving this one to my friend with her little Christmas planner. But yeah, I just, well, actually, I think I will keep the gingerbread actually, because it goes with this. I might give my friend this one with the little planner, because I think that'd be nice for her to just drink her tea out and plan for Christmas. And I might just put some plans in there where she's gonna be spending time with me. <laughs> Passively, aggressively, hello, you're so pretty today. Um, so yeah, this is this. I'm gonna add a little section now so you can see some of the extra bits that they have in the little like bit in home bargains.
guys, honestly, such beautiful bits in there. The lady did say there will be more stuff coming. But I wanted to share this with you. I know it's early, but sometimes these things just sell so quickly. And she did say that to me today. She was like, because I was like, I like the crazy woman buying Christmas stuff so early. And she was like, honestly, the amount of times we've had people come in and go, I'm not going to get it yet. It's not Christmas. And then when they go to get it, they're like, where's this? Where's that? And they're like, I'm really sorry. It's gone. Um, because it sells quickly. My eye, this eye looks so much smaller than this eye today. It's because I put my makeup on to sort of make my eyes more pop. But my waterline here is just running and making my... Are you barking at me to come back in? Oh, I'm very sorry. I'm very sorry, but you was barking earlier, trying to be the big girl with the seagulls. And she didn't want to come in when I called you. And now you're barking at me. I just assumed you're barking still at the seagull. Um, so yeah, my waterline's a bit... <laughs> smudgy but yeah hopefully you've enjoyed this video guys and you can get your hands on some of these bits if you fancy it but yeah i'm going to pop these away now and hide these from gary because well when i got the b m stuff if you haven't caught that video the christmas stuff i was like yeah but you know what i've got everything i need now i don't need to get anything else gal so i'm just gonna put these in the b m bag and pretend that it was from the same whole shop so that he will not be any the wiser. So yeah, hopefully you've enjoyed this video. She says drinking out of a pumpkin mug because it's still October, showing Christmas stuff. I'm Rosie Henshaw. I'll see you later. Take care. Bye. I'm actually in really comfy slippers. That's what Gary shall get if he tells me not to buy that more stuff. Put him in his box. <laughs> right, I've got to go, I've got to go.